Hey everybody, welcome back to another Logan Drinks. Uh, glad we can have this one here because today we are going to be trying three olives vodka. And this is a fairly large piece, so I'm going to actually have to hold it up for the camera here. Um, three olives vodka is actually made in England. It is a 40% alcohol by volume and an 80 proof. Um, and I can check that here in just a second, make sure that's right. Um, nice, beautiful piece. Uh, let's bring that just back in. Um, so it's kind of fun because with this piece, I'm sure you guys might have already been able to tell. Um, the fog on the side of it, you know, at first you think, well, that's kind of weird. You know, they didn't finish up with it. And then you turn it and you just face it forward and you realize because there are these olives here in the back on the uh, back panel here and I'll flip it around for you guys so you can see that so you got these olives here on the back panel well they actually have the accent piece for when it is facing you actually have three olives in the martini glass which personally I think that's awesome I, I love it when uh, companies just kind of go out of their way with the artwork especially um, it is a fairly larger piece obviously so uh, this definitely is not going to be, uh, on your bottom shelf just because of how cool the bottle is by itself. Um, this I would say is one of your other mid tier, uh, not top shelf. Um, I would say maybe middle shelf. You definitely want it to be eye level. So that way, you know, you can get the full effect of this. Um, this is going to be a blind test, so I do not actually know how the taste is yet because I have not tried this one. Um, so we're going to be reviewing that. I don't have any background on that yet. But um, let me just check here, and I'll verify with you guys. 40% um, alcohol and 80 proof. So that is right. Um, I do know one thing about it, at least. <laughs> so, so we will get to trying it here in a second. Um, once again relatively cheap piece um i think at the time that i paid for this maybe 30 dollars i might be exaggerating that a little bit might be a little less um a lot of things if you can't tell on this channel have either been bought a while ago or there were so many things bought at one time a lot of prices might have gotten mixed around so check with your local retailer um but i Certainly, I don't think that it's going to be too much at all. So we're going to pour out a nice shot here. Okay. I'm going to try and keep this into the shot as much as I can, because the artwork is just awesome. I love this artwork so much. Um, once again, this is 3O, which is three olives. Um, it's beautiful, really nice piece. Um, without further ado, here we go. Oh. Okay. Hmm. So, right off the bat, it doesn't. Okay, I'm trying to figure the best way of wording this for you, because I do like the bottle, and obviously the artwork is to my liking, personal preference, but it's definitely not a vodka that you can just have shots of. Um, it's... It's almost lacking, I would say. Um, there are better vodkas, and of course, you do get what you pay for, and I understand that completely as well. However, if I match this bottle up with another $30 bottle of vodka um, and just do a blind taste test, I probably would not choose this three olives. Once again, you know, points for creativity on the bottle, but it's, it's kind of lacking. It's a bit lackluster, you know. Especially with vodkas, I uh, I kind of like the little bite to it. Uh, I like the nice feel, but uh, with this, it's it's almost like it's watered down, just about you know. 
and and it's nice it's just not it's not what I expect right like I expect for the amount of money that I paid or lack thereof I expect to have a certain bite to it um, and I just I don't get it you know it's real smooth and I, you can let me back up a little bit you can taste the alcohol it's not it's not like it's all water and you can't taste it and you're getting ripped off you can taste the alcohol but it is not to the extent that you may want or you might not be like me and you might want that you might want the more subtle approach to your night um but if you're doing shots this is one that'll sneak up on you just because it's it's one of those that it's just like you know oh man that was that was fine uh, you know let's do another one and then you know you keep doing it and keep doing it and finally it hits you and it's like geez that sucked like i could have had a much better night if i switched over to a different vodka if i switched over to a gin it, it's it's okay it's not i think this might be the first time on the channel where i say you know save your money and maybe go and get something different um it's it's not bad and certainly if you like the artwork and you're a collector just for bottles alone this is definitely a piece to have it's beautiful it's awesome beautifully made um it's just flavor wise you know and i understand it's not it's not a flavored vodka by any means so i'm not i'm not trying to say that you know it's lacking in flavor because it, it doesn't have the same flavor and i get that but it's not it doesn't live up to the expectations that other brands have put out there i i feel it's just it's not to the same caliber as another bottle of the same price um but with that being said still went down smooth um you can still mix it with other things if that's what you're doing if you're not trying to do straight shots then why are you even listening to me that it's that is completely your decision do as you must you can mix it with anything it's just it's kind of lackluster I, I think we'll leave it at that um yeah i just I, I feel like i've been let down because you know looking right at the bottle it's like beautiful and then you get there and it's just like you know it was it was there it was a vodka but so this has been a review um i hope you kind of enjoyed it a little bit i know that uh we might not be giving this the fair share that it has probably deserved so let us know in the comments below if we're just getting that completely wrong or if uh if you kind of agree with us after trying it yourself that you know maybe they might not be living up to the expectations set by other brands uh this is logan have a great night remember to drink responsibly and always make smart decisions thank you